Okay. I think we're going to get started. I think. There we go. And there we go. Beautiful. I know. Imagine getting started. Loaf was just here. Loaf, where did you go? Loaf was here, and then she wandered off. Uh, happy Friday, everyone. I hope y'all are doing well. Uh, I'm... Whew. I've had a tiring couple of weeks. Insomnia has been kicking my ass, but it's okay. I'm here, and we're going to be doing Firebot stuff today. I'm going to be breaking stuff, which I'm a big fan of doing. Um, we we'll talk about some of the stuff coming up in the new update uh, here in the next couple of weeks. Nice, nice, Dennis. Nice, buddy. Yeah, Osh, it's uh, it's been. Yeah. yeah, the last couple of weeks have been rough. Most nights getting to sleep after 3 a.m., like 2 a.m. minimum. So, not been ideal, but we're we're getting there, folks. We're gonna get there one of these year days. Anyway, um, hello, hello. Uh, I saw Osh and Liz, Dennis, Fire. Welcome into all of you, and to all of you out there lurking. Welcome, welcome. It is wonderful to see everyone. Uh, give me one second, because I'm getting... I did just have to restart a bunch of things. Uh, so... I'm getting things cleaned up and cleared up. That works. I'm happy with that. Uh, beautiful. What in the heck did I just do? Okay. That's true. That's what happens, Liz. You gotta you gotta watch out. My bear will show up out of nowhere. Um Anyway. That's right, that's right. Hi, Aval. How are you? In your office, sleep's gotten better. Vice is in the office. It's bedtime. That's probably a good call, Dennis. Honestly, probably a very, very good call. Um. All right. So, uh, first of all, let's do a little bit of fun housekeeping stuff. Um. All right. Where's big screen? Big screen. All right. So, uh, latest update that we put out. Um, not even a week ago now. I'm good, Avil. I'm good. I hope you're doing well. Oh, I'm glad you're doing well. I'm, listen, I know words. I know how words. I know words. I'll figure them out one day. Anyway, uh, we put out the latest update. We had a patch that went out, uh, over the weekend last weekend, uh, to fix a couple of things. That version has been downloaded over 3,500 times now. Um, so thank you all so much. Um, like 3,300 of those over 3,300 have been just people updating their local version of Firebot. So thank you all all so much for continuing to use our stuff. Uh, we really appreciate it. And we, we make this for y'all. So, uh, the new variable stuff. Yeah. Like there's, we knew there would be some growing pains with that, but the overall benefits we knew would be like long-term be a lot better just to be able to manage the data better under the hood. And it's just, mwah, oh, it's so good. It's so good. Reject did an amazing job getting all that cleaned up and, and working better and stuff. Um, but I mean, the variable system has been his baby for a long time now. Uh, he actually writes the uh, library that does all of the, the parsing and whatnot for our variables, uh, what he calls expression-ish. And it's really nicely designed, so. Sick. Oh, buddy, you got to not be sick. You got to not do that. You got to feel better. You got to, I hope you're feeling better. Um, but yeah, so 
561.2 is the latest version that is out right now. Um, you all remember if, uh, if you were here for Fire Rock Friday last re last Friday, uh, that's when we worked on it and released 561 um, with all the, the rework to the variable system and a um, bunch of new things. And then um, now we're up to 561.2 because we found some stuff and got some things patched. So again, thanks to everybody for their feedback. Thanks as always to our Firebot experts for kind of being in the trenches in the Discord and helping folks diagnose issues, get those bug reports in, and a lot of times get fixes submitted up for us. I um, really, really appreciate y'all's work on that. Uh, we could not do it without you. Um, but yeah, super excited to see over 3,500 downloads of the latest release, not even a week old. Uh, and then we've got another one that we're hoping to get out before too terribly long, but we've got to see how much stuff we're going to put in at first. Speaking of, let's look at some of the stuff that's coming up in the next update. So we've been kind of keeping with a the theme lately, right? The 560 and above series, we have been... Some things have been changing, some things we've we've had to break some older functionality. Some of that is just because Twitch is like, hey, you have to change how you're doing stuff. We gotta we gotta do what Twitch says. Um some of it is because we're trying to get things sort of modernized and cleaned up and um consistent in Firebot itself. Five six one with the variable update is a perfect example of that. Just a bunch of stuff where variables have been added over the course of years and some of them work differently than others so we're just trying to get them into a better place um so that everything works consistently works well and yeah some of firebot's code base is very old because you know a lot of you may not realize firebot's origins go back to mixer back before it was mixer back when it was still beam um so Firebot is several years old, and there's just a lot of stuff that's been there for a very long time, which is great that we've got such a long-lived project. It just means that over time, some of that stuff builds up. And so we want to make sure that we get uh, get things cleaned up, get things more consistent, and set it up to be better long-term for everyone, not just for you all as our users, but for us as the developers too. It just makes it easier for us to, one, build new features, two, fix bugs, and three, prevent new bugs. So we've been doing a lot of that work the last few months. Um, God, I, I dare say like the last year we've been doing a lot of that. So uh, yeah, so let's talk about some stuff. First of all, though, I do have a, I do have a want to see, say blah, 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 blah. I do want to show y'all something that one of our community members made. Uh Sally, hi, welcome in. Good to see you. Thank you for the lurk. Um, I'll give you a wave because I saw you have the the no audio. Um so Oceanity. Um she and I have known each other for several years on the interwebs. Um, but turns out she also uses Firebot and um one of the things that she has recently made which I thought was cool, and I did not realize until she said something that earlier this stream was that her this project is actually based on Firebot. It's actually built into Firebot. So she's built a bot, a uh, a Mastodon bot called Burbfax. Uh, I can let me post this in chat so everyone can see it. So there's a link to the account. Um, burp facts are not actually factual unless by some strange coincidence they actually are. Um, but so she's using a public API to pull, uh, data and photos of these birds and then post them on Mastodon. But what's really funny about this is she's using it's Firebot to power hustling. this. Hi, Zammy. Zam's over here posting my about. I got to redo that because that's too many words. That's that's a lot of words. Um, but anyway, so uh, Osh, if you want to post a link to the uh, 
to the project itself, please feel free. But this burb fact feed posting to this feed is po actually powered by Firebot, which I think is amazing and a terrible use of Firebot in the best way. It's so good. It's so, so good. Um, your startup scripts jumbled together. Nice. I love it. I love it. Um, but yeah, so uh, OSHA's built a, a custom script or a plugin for Firebot and that handles all of this. Um, I know for those of you who have been around for any length of time, you have seen some of the stuff that I have built with Firebot in plugins where I can manage my whole stream. What are you kids doing in my house? Cracko, what are you doing? Cracko, get out. Joke's on you, you're still a broccoli's. Things all nice and OOP. Yes, we love a good OOP. Um, but yeah, I just think this is really cool that Osh built a plugin for Firebot that actually runs her Burbfax account. And that's just, that's so funny and cool to me. I love it so much. So yeah, go check out Burbfax. It's really, really great. I love it. I think it's fantastic. Uh, if you have anything that you have built with Firebot that you think is really cool, you can join our Discord. Uh, where is the link to the Discord? Don't worry about it, Bobo. Don't worry about it. It's fine. Just don't worry about it. Um, here, I will post this in here. There we go. Yeah, there's just... there's. Firebot is a is a pretty open platform that lets you do a lot of cool stuff, and I just I I love the the kind of stuff that people make with it. So if you have a thing that you have built with Firebot that you would like to show off, we would love to see it. Join the Discord. There's a project showcase channel. You'll find it down near the bottom of the channel list. The last things that are, were posted in there were the well this and my Windows ninety eight scene that I made because Firebot powers some of this stuff. Um. So go post your stuff in there, just, you know, stuff that you've worked on. Like, we, we love to see it. We absolutely love to see it. Um, so, Osh, thank you for sharing that with us. This is so cool. Like, it's just, it's just wild that this is being powered by Firebot. Like, I just, I love it. And I can see it's running, like, every four hours, which is just great. Uh, okay. So that's cool. That's done. Let me pull this back down here. We don't need this anymore. There we go. Okay. Uh, so listen, I sent, I sent that URL to the discord from the dashboard, right? Like very unceremonious. However, this does bring up something that's coming in the next version. So we know that sometimes connections to Twitch chat can be unreliable. And we're currently using three connections to Twitch. Um, one for the streamer, because that's the, the main chat feed that comes in and how we process um, commands and whatnot. One for the bot, uh, so the bot can receive whispers. That's all that that connection is used for. And then we also have one for um uh the stream a second one for the streamer so that we can send messages out so that we can receive them back on the like the incoming message loop uh so that we can properly process um messages from the streamer as if they're coming from everyone else because we had some issues in the past where um things like um like cooldowns and, and weirdness with commands that you send from the dashboard would not uh, process like everything like it's supposed to. Like it was outside of the normal command processing loop. So it was really weird. God damn it, Bobo. No you dabs. Where's my, where's my no you button? Reverse! Reverse! Yeah. Get wrecked, Bobo. Um... But, I'm just the, 
Hyperate script. What the Dennis? What the hell is that? What are you even talking about? Anyway, um, so sending messages from chat from the dashboard is something that's been a part of Firebot for ages, and it's just a normal part of it. But we know that the connection to Twitch's IRC chat interface can sometimes be weird and wonky. So we're trying to start minimizing some of that and find other routes. Recently, Twitch has updated their APIs to where we can send chat messages over what they call their REST API, which is basically us just saying, hey, here's a chat message, here's where it's going, send it, okay, just go. Um, oh, that's cool, Dennis, that's really, that's actually really cool. Uh, so just go send the, like go send this chat message to this channel as this user. That's what we want. We don't need like an entire IRC connection for that. And Twitch knows that you know people are doing chat in different ways now. So they've updated that, and we've updated that under the hood for Twitch or for uh, for Firebot, so that when we connect to Twitch, we can just send messages from either the streamer or the bot account over the um the the new api so we don't have to maintain a separate connection to chat just to send messages from the streamer account cracko always wants waffle fries cracko bro go get waffle fries just go do it go up so you can a script so you can use it in commands and events and stuff oh that's really neat that's pretty cool anyway so sending a message from here like this it looks like, again, unceremonious, like who cares? But under the hood, it's actually a little bit more reliable now um, because it uses a different transport method than we were using before. And it's one less thing to break. Um, we also had some issues around where if you did have a little blip in your connection to uh, Twitch chat, we would show up a thing down here that says chat's disconnected, we're trying to reconnect but that message might not go away. That's also fixed in uh, coming out in the next version. So that's a that's a nice like a, a nice quality of life. Uh, so thanks to CKY for kind of tracking that down for us. Oh, uh, let's go see what's been changed. What else has been changed in the version five branch? Let's see. Uh, cleaned up some like error messages in the logs, you know, stuff like that. Um, more different, well, excuse me, long message stuff. Um, Dennis put in a fix for, uh, renaming quick actions. It would work, but it wouldn't like there was an error in the UI. So the UI was just being wonky. Um, also fixed some things around the usage text around the text pad, start and text pad end new variables. So that's all, that's all some, you know, just great little stuff that's coming in the next version, which Again, really excited about. Um, love you, Bobo. Mwah. Go get your get your coffees. Um, so yeah, we've got we've got like a a, ni a bunch of nice fixes that are coming. Some that's under the hood. Some that's you know actually a little bit of functionality change that's just really transparent to you, our users. But for us, it's important that we you know try to make things even more solid and reliable. Um, Dennis, do I, do I show them the other, the big thing I've been working on last week or so? Work is being done for more poll and prediction variables. Yes, that's true. Dennis is working on uh, new stuff. Yeah, we're, we're waiting on the, the new version of Twerple for that, which as soon as we get a new version, Dennis, and I can put that in, I'll let you know. Um, let's see, am I on that branch? Yes. Okay, so, Dennis, would you would you like to uh, queue up your uh, your alt account so that we can show this in all of its full glory? So, one of the things that we have is the viewer database, right? So, uh, I have, I'm, I'm in my own viewer database. Now there's certain things that it doesn't track on me because I'm the streamer. Like I don't track stats. Like don't, I don't care how much view time or chat messages that I've had in my own channel. 
because I'm the streamer. It's my channel. I don't want to track that kind of stuff for me. Okay. Now, I am an active user. I show up in the viewer list. You know, I can do all that kind of stuff. But for most of the other viewers, like let's say Krakow, okay, there's Krakow. He's watched a lot of the stream. He's said a bunch of shit and, and he has seven yikes, which you don't want to yikes. Um, but we track stuff for our viewers in the viewer database if you have the viewer database enabled. One of the things that we f we updated in, I think it was 61. Was that 61? Uh, yeah, okay. So in 61, we redid, uh, we redid how we handle the viewer database a little bit because we were doing a lot of tracking by username or display name, and those aren't reliable because those can change. So for tracking users or viewers in the viewer database, we now do things by um, their internal Twitch ID number. Like every, every Twitch user has an ID that never changes for that account, always stays the same. No matter if you ever change your, your username, your display name, whatever, um, it works like that that user ID always stays the same. So we track a bunch of stuff by this now, which means when someone changes their username or their display name, the next time they show up in your chat on your stream, we update their stuff in the database. So that cleared up most, both some errors that we were having and some weirdness around how things were being handled. So we're starting to do more work around that. Uh, go ahead, Dennis, fire away. One of the other things that we keep having issues with is if you look in the Twitch chat, you can see that Dennis has an alt account, Dennis off the internet, but this account has its language set to Japanese, okay? Because we've done so many things by username or display name, that presents even a, like bigger problems around some of the things that we do in Firebot because we haven't been doing everything by the user's internal ID. However, we've been doing a lot of work around this to better support users that have one of these, what we what are called Unicode display names. So they're just using like non-English characters. Um, on Twitch, that consists of people who have languages set to Japanese, Chinese, or Korean, okay? Because they can have a display name that is localized to their language, which means something that doesn't have like A through Z or, um, you know, zero through nine, whatever. So because those are handled differently, we wanted to make sure that we handle them properly in Firebot. So if you look here now in my viewer list, you can see that Dennis's alt account is showing up here with his actual, uh, with his Japanese display name but we also include his actual login name, his username that he has to log into Twitch with off to the side so that you also know who it is, just like you would see in the use in the, the Twitch chat. Okay. Um, now when I click on this, you see again, the Japanese version, the Japanese display name up here. But we also include what his actual username is underneath. A little less prominent, but still like, you know, easy to see so that you know who this actually is, okay? If I go to my viewer list, you can see the same thing here where we show it in the list here. And again, of course, it pops that same, that viewer information dialogue. So we want to better handle folks that have international display names, because we know that we have a lot of users that are outside of, um, that are in one of these regions where they can use their, again, Japanese, Chinese, or Korean name, display names for their user profile in on Twitch. So that's all great. And even if I search Twitch now, and if I wanna look up, I can look up Dennis off the internet, and, and I can find, there it is there, or, I can actually take and copy his Japanese display name. And when I do the search, 
which will also return that back for me because it does match someone's name. And so I can see that here. So our viewer search shows that now. And again, it displays this so that we can better see it. And you, whenever you're searching for users, you can have a better idea to make sure that this is the correct person because without that user login name to know for sure, you may not know, right? So that's all done. That's all great. But then another problem presents itself. So one of the other things that we do that's really important with viewers in Twitch is roles. Okay, so we have internal roles that are internal to Firebot, like the active viewers to know who's actually like in chat and has chatted in the last 15 minutes. We also have Twitch roles. So things for like subscribers, VIPs, moderators, uh, ones for each individual tier of subscriber, things like that. And then we have custom roles. Custom roles are ones that you as the user of Firebot can define to say, hey, I want to be able to check, you know, against this specific role for permissions. For instance, I have one for an auto shout out so that when certain people show up in my chat, when they arrive, I see if they are in that list. And if they are, we autom like the bot automatically gives them a shout out and does like all the shout out stuff for them, which is great. But prior, we were not handling these international, these Unicode display names properly for those roles because we were doing it by display name and things got a little weird when we were doing the comparisons. So we've gone through and we're refactoring the way that we handle roles under the hood to no longer do it by username or display name, but by that ID that always stays the same for a particular user, okay? So if I go to my viewer roles, you can see I have my different roles here, like my auto shout out. And then I have this test role over here. Now, custom roles prior to this upcoming update, custom roles as they are in Firebot today, they track by display name. So when I add someone to the list, it adds their display name. So for Dennis, for example, it shows, I, if I were to add Dennis's normal account, his main account to my uh, custom role, it would show up as Dennis on the internet with each word capitalized because that's how his display name is set up on Twitch. Now his login name just happens to be the same, the same username, just all lowercase because he's not in a Japanese, Chinese or Korean language setting. However, his alt account is, it's Japanese. So it doesn't work quite the same way and we can't get his actual, we can't directly correlate his username to his display name without doing some searching and some logic on it, which makes things a little bit harder to test for and things like that. So in the next update of Firebot, we're redoing custom, we're redoing roles altogether, but we're redoing custom roles specifically to handle these IDs better, which is gonna result in a couple of things. One, if you have someone whose display name has, is who they have changed their display name or they have changed their username, their role does, their custom role doesn't work for them already today and it will not migrate to the new system, okay? It's just a new file format where we actually look up and correlate the first time to verify who each user is. Um, but that's not going to, their stuff won't migrate over cause it's not valid today. Okay. So if I go in and put like Dennis on the internet 75, because there's not a Dennis on the internet 75, I checked. Um, if I try to migrate that over, it's not going to work because you know, say, or Dennis changes his name from Dennis on the internet to Dennis on the internet 75. If I try to migrate that over, it's not going to work because it doesn't match and we I, I, we'll be able to find that and directly correlate it. So if I had like an auto shout out set up for him and he changed his username right now, it's not going to work because he changed his username it no longer works. Okay. We want to relieve some of that too. So to fix all of this, we are going to change the way that custom roles store user data. Instead of storing just the display name for each user in a custom role, 
we will store their username, their display name, and also that unique ID that every single user has that never changes. Which means that when we come into a role where someone has Japanese, Korean, or Chinese characters, we can see who they are, we have their actual login name next to their display name, and we can see all of that, and we can properly track by them in the new version because we know what that user's ID is every time they do something like a chat message or uh, a redemption or something like that. So I'm really excited about this because this means that we can add, like if I wanna do CKY who's currently sleeping, there's CKY and add him to the list. So he shows up normally like, and again, this is more consistent with the way Twitch displays, right? So on Twitch chat, CKY's name looks just like this because that's the way his display name is set up. He's got it set up as just a capitalized version of his login name, but it's not inherently different than his display name as it is with folks who have one of these international display names. This is the way that Twitch displays Dennis's name in chat. So that's the way that we want to display it throughout Firebot. Again, to be more consistent with the way that Twitch does things. It just makes more sense. So we're doing a lot of work around that to make sure that one, we handle roles better just overall. And two, we handle international usernames or display names better too, because we know we have a lot of those users and we want to make sure that Firebot works well for everyone, especially folks that, you know, may not always get that kind of that attention that they deserve. Right. So that's a lot of the stuff that we're working on right now. We do have a couple of other things that are in the works. Um, let me see. Yeah, I really wish I might not be able to do this just yet. Yeah, we can figure that out. We'll figure it out. Um, but this is the kind of this is the custom role updates that are coming. So again, the first time that you start up Firebot after we release this version, which we have no ETA on yet, we will automatically migrate your custom roles over. Double check your custom roles because some of them may not migrate. If again, if their display name is no longer valid, if they change their username, things like that. Those folks don't migrate over just because we don't know who they are. We can't look them up, which also, again, which means they don't work in your custom role today anyway. So there's not much we can do about that. Um, but then uh, after that, they're migrated and they continue working the way they have. So for you, it really is transparent. It's just a matter of double checking, making sure people are in their custom roles and putting them back if they need to be put back, which is just as easy as looking them up and clicking the button. Um, all right, we've got an ad starting, so I'm gonna let the ad run and then I'm gonna go get ready to do some terrible stuff. I'm also gonna move this out of the way. That's off the screen. Uh, this is when I was testing migration. I don't need that anymore. Okay. Terrible stuff. Love terrible stuff. Big, big fan of terrible stuff. Perry, what are you doing? Perry, aren't you working? Aren't they giving you six, like, 70-hour work weeks up there? All right, let's, let me get through the ad break because I want to, yeah, let's see, what can I get open? Can I open the entire folder? I cannot open the entire folder. But I'm about to. Yeah. Yeah, after working too much this week, they started already Tuesday. Now it's good lord. Sorry, buddy, you gotta take a break. You gotta just you gotta just relax. Ah. Oh. Alright. 
Let's see. Did you stop down there? Yeah. There we go. Oh yeah, getting some chill Minecraft vibes. Love this. Okay. Ad breaks over. Good. Do I can't just work? I don't like have anything else to spend your time on while you're hurt. Yeah, I don't. I don't know. It's just like, like if you're not hurting anybody, I don't know. Follow restriction for commands. Is that switched to ID yet? Um, let me go look. User follows channel. Are we still doing this? Oh, because I used to have that in there. We do get users by name. Yeah. So yeah, we've been we've been doing that for a little while, Dennis. Um because when Twerple 6.0 came out, a lot of stuff changed. Um and then we went through and redid a bunch of stuff a couple of months ago with the event sub integration. So for a couple of months now that's been the case. Working environment act or something? Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Gee, I wonder why they how, why would they do that, Perry? Why why would you why would they do that? So yes, Dennis. Uh well, yes and no. I mean it's we check the username and we check the username, but we check it by ID. So I'm twenty years, I don't know all this new stuff. I've been self employed again for a few months now. I'm having to get reaccustomed to everything. An issue in the past with localized usernames as well. Probably. We we'll probably fix that though. Well, let's go. Hell, let's go fix it now. Then screw it. And I'm here. Hi, Hilti. Oh, did that? Did it not work? Why is it not working? Oh, I bet. I bet it was being janky earlier. Here, I can, I can fix you real quick. Hold on. Oh, resets. Nope. Okay, it's busted. Hold on. They're not working. Why is it not working? See, Hiltzy has a custom role on my channel. So he gets shouted out automatically. There we go. Okay, fixed it. There you go, Hiltzy. Showing up and breaking shit. That's right. That's what we do. Ooh, woo. See, Liz gets to, to use her sub sound because she's a subscriber. And that's a role that we check as well. Oh, you know what, Dennis? You have to use user ID name there. I think you have to use user ID name there. I think.
Oh no, no, it pulls it in automatically, doesn't it? Okay, I have a better idea. Hey, Dennis. Dennis, do you want to see me break some stuff? Okay. So listen, let's, you know what, I'm actually going to close all of this. We're going to start with the most, one of the biggest parts of how we do things in Firebot. Chat. So when we get a chat message, we have all this stuff that we do. Okay. And one of the things that we do uh, is... To do, we build out this whole message. Let's just go here for a second. Okay, so in Firebot, things are a little weird, okay? Part of this is just the migration over from Mixer to Twitch, and things just, they don't match up one-to-one. -one. You still think we should add that badge to our names in the chat feed? Perry, I'm ser very seriously considering it. Um, on Twitch, a user ID is a user ID, a username is the login name, and the user display name is what you show people, like whether it's like your capitalization format or your like localized international name, like we were just talking about. In Firebot, the user ID is the user ID, the username is the display name, and the user ID name is the login name. We don't have the concept of display name everywhere. Some places we do, some places we don't. Some places username is the actual username. Um, viewer database, I think, is like that. If I go to viewers, to the viewer database, and we look at our Firebot viewer, and say we have, a, we have the ID, which is what we use the Twitch ID for, the username and the display name, okay? This is essentially what Twitch gives us, is this same format, okay? That make a difference for this? Yes, you'll see, it absolutely does. That means you get one extra day of me breaking shit. So things in Firebot under the hood and with some of the variable stuff get a little weird because Username's not username, username is display name. It just gets really weird. So, what if... What if... What if we change it? What if we change the way that we do this, this whole paradigm? Now, here's, here's what this is going to ch break, essentially. Will there be consequences? Yes, absolutely. There will absolutely be consequences to this. However, for non-international users, the only noticeable change will be that places where you use username will go from capitalized sometimes 
to always lowercase. That's it. For international users, for localized usernames, this will actually end up fixing some things. So like, that's, that's what I keep saying, Perry. That's, what I, that's, that's my whole point. Like if there's a time to break it, now is the time to break it. But this is something that will actually end up fixing a lot of things under the hood. Um, so let's go here and see what happens, right? Let's see. Do I have... That's a basic... Where am I using the basic one? I'm using it somewhere. Figure out metadata username. Oh, that's fine. That's gonna get fixed anyway. Ha 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 Um. Can I search for references? Oh yeah. Oh, this is gonna get hairy, and I'm into it. Okay. Um. So listen. Hey, Dennis. Should I go make a new variable, Dennis? Because you know the answer already. Okay, Dennis says I should go make a new variable. Okay. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay. We'll go. F. Let's go back to oh, we can we can go user display name. <laughs> That's a fair point, Liz. That's a fair point. Ah. Okay. Display name. Display name. Okay. Beautiful. Mwah. Absolutely love it. So, what do we have here in? You know, be in Florida and it dawned on you, you'll be at Disney on May 4th. Oh, Hiltzy. Oh, buddy. Oh, buddy. You're, uh... Listen, I don't know how to tell you this, but there's going to be a lot of people there. There's going to be several... There's going to be several everybody's there. Yeah, what Liz said. 
Okay. That's user display name. Go at it. Do to do. Lovely. And you told your mom that now through that, that day regardless, her and the kiddo can do whatever they want. Nice. Let's make this user display name. I like user display name better. Where's my build Firebot message? Oh, there it is. Yeah, we're gonna use user display name. That works. Mm-hmm. 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 Nice. I like that. Okay. What else do we use display name? All right. Perfect. How long is cooldown on lights? Uh, half an hour, I think. Uh, where the hell is it? Oh, fifteen minutes. Oh yeah, love some pig step. On your birthday... Hmm... May 3rd? Aww. That's like, that's a few days before me and Bean's bearversary. We're just gonna do that. I guess, why not? Eh, no. No, I... Mm, mm, mm. It'll be fine. Alright. Ah, oh, yeah. Get there. Still waiting on events, um... All right. Yep. Yep. Okay. That's that's all squared away. Do they? Uh, neither. It's the uh, it's the ninth. Okay. Well, that part's done. Let me go... 
I'm gonna go turn off some of the turn off some stuff for now. Actually, I guess I could just turn off the deactivate the set. Yeah, okay. Uh, now what I can do is... I'm probably gonna just... Yep, I would love to. Refactor role management. And... All right, backup's done. No way easier than prediction. Yeah, yeah, they are. They sure are. They sure are. Listen, when you said you were gonna take those on, I'm like, okay, enjoy polls. See how you like predictions. Because predictions are a pain in the ass. You started with, yeah, I mean, they're still, polls are still easier. Nice. It's fixed. Now we just wait for it to actually get released. Okay. Let's see here. Now we go fix this. Do, do, do. So that's showing the username, but we want the display name. Where's my GUI? Gooey, gooey stuff. Chat. Did that actually work? I'm not sure that it did. Oh, maybe it, it, it might not have worked since I restarted the button. Yeah, it might not have worked since I restarted. Cuz it's it's it doesn't have the connection to the uh the thing yet. Wait, no, it's not in here. It's in I'll give it a minute to do its thing. Maybe it'll show up. Uh, let's see. Okay. Okay. We should technically always have username. Let's see. Yeah. 
Did you stop again? Oh no, it's just quiet. I can leave that because I don't really care that much. Message context menu. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. Okay. So that's updated. So now we can restart the bot. All right. Uh, okay. Hey, uh, Dennis, you want to hit something in the, uh, you want to hit something with your alt account? Oh, sorry. Sorry, bud. I should probably spin up one of those at some point. But display name is is correct there, which is what I want. Race is almost nice. Hi, Ever. I love you. Oh, uh, let's see. Happy Friday. Thanks, Dennis. I mean, it works. Do we get the... Color. Do we get color info from this? I don't know that we do. It's color. There's color. Oh, it is. Okay, so it is there. Generate right, your own color for this user and stick to it for at least one runtime. Hmm. Me. It's fine. That's fine. Very meaningful. Extremely meaningful. But it works. Like it's things are things are where they should be. Oh, that's something else I can fix here. Let's do that. 
Uh, where is that? It's yes, it's very breaking. Oh, wait, I gotta swap that around. All right, let's fire it back up again. I feel like this is going to be something that I'm going to have to change the uh, CSS on. No, it shouldn't. It should be fine because it's because it cuts off now. So it's, it'll it should it should be fine. There we go. All right, Dennis, you want to do one more from the alt? Good enough for me. I think that's good enough. I think that works. Look, it even shows up in the activity feed over here with your name. Love that. All right, um, you arrived. Got feed alert. Hey, uh, who wants to throw something in chat real quick? Anybody? Doesn't matter who. Look at that. User display name, look at all, look at that. That's beautiful. Hmm. Hi, Arb. How you doing, buddy? Okay, that works. Okay, so user display name works as expected, which is great. Uh, let's go to run a test. No, test. Yeah, okay. I thought I mistyped it. Uh, let's go user display name and um, let's see what Tom, let's see if it returns Tom's because I know Tom's not here right now. Dave's not here, man. Okay, there's his display name. And that returns me the way it should be. Okay, cool. Uh, well, I like that. Very happy with that. Now, let's go do something else terrible.
How else do we do deprecated in this? Okay, so we'll mark it as deprecated. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Any difference at all with user and username? No. No, Dennis, there is not. Username literally is user. Same thing. No, it usually, it, it literally uses users evaluator. something we had a while back because everyone's nagging about how username being the variable every other service yeah yeah it was user and then we added username because username like a lot of other people were using username so we just added it as a convenience okay that's done that's done done That's, I think that's done. I want to go back and look at it again. Message that username. Perfect. Where do we use user ID down here? Oh, the show user details modal. Perfect. Exactly what I would expect. Nope, didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's. Good. Standardization. Guess I could bump myself into voice in case anybody shows up. Yeah, what the heck, why not? <clears throat> the other way around, seeing we use username everywhere in code, I think we use username and everyone else user. Yeah. I, yeah, I, I don't know. I'm really tempted to reverse the, like it doesn't really, it doesn't matter. It truly does not matter under the hood, but like, I'm just, ugh.
Oh God. Oh God. Oh man. Who doggy? That's gonna be a lot. All right, let's. Wait a minute. Oh, it should. It doesn't even matter because we we should have. We should have. Oh yeah. Oh man. Oh. This one, Perry. I'm. I ain't faulting you for it. What is this? The subscribe. Okay. Oh God. You know what I'm going to do? I want to see something real quick because I've changed a few things here already. That's a raid. I know we get that data. Follow I know is good. Sub I know is good. Yep. Fire, you look concerned, buddy. That's a gift sub upgrade. Here. I know cheers would get good. Data. Let's see. There it goes. Viewer arrived. I know viewer arrived. We get that data. I'm almost certain. Yep. Mm. Let me see what kind of API they'll be bringing to the table. Uh, I know LiveSpace also just started some testing with their API as well, which I'm curious about.
live space I'm I'm eventually going to like that's going to be one of the ones that I work on for uh V6 Nope. Okay. Oh, there's a small flower. Look at their APIs at the door. Yeah. Yeah. Suppose people want them to add except from kick support. Yeah, listen, I'm just I'm not going anywhere near kick. No fucking way. No fucking way. Yeah, it absolutely is. I'm just... I have no interest in it whatsoever. I think I have my... Username... I have my username reserved over there, but... That's mostly just a... That's almost exclusively to squat on it. I'm not... Yeah, no. Just... Just no. That's about it. Yeah. Hi, paintbrush. How you doing, buddy? No, they don't. They don't care about the issues because they're making money. Got to use name. Yeah, pretty much, Barry. No, 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 Louis. This is, this is what I'm doing today. I'm breaking shit. I have reserved the right. I called it in ahead of time. Louis, how you doing, buddy? Fritz, how you doing, Fritz? On today, fire. I am working on breaking usernames. Or the way that we handle usernames under the hood in Firebot. So today we use username as the display name that we get from Twitch. And then we have like a separate user ID name. It's just, it's kind of a mess. It's kind of a mess. So I'm going through and refactoring this to see... If I can do it, uh, make, make things a little more consistent. Since we've been breaking stuff the last couple of versions anyway. A little confusing. Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh, she good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Good. I've been here. It's 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 the other Oshi. There's two of you now. 
<laughs> two Oshis. I can do a... What the hell, why not? And what, what about second Oshi? It's true. Life with all the stupid shit you do. Buddy, we have talked about this. You have got to just... You gotta not do that. Trigger announcement. That's just so much cleaner. It's just... It's beautiful. Usernames are usernames. I'm gonna remove user ID name from everything. Everything. Oh, uh, not everything, but... Uh, mm, 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 mm. Hi, Tay. What you doing? What you eating? When your colleagues stop asking questions that require the answer, fuck around and find out. How very Scottish of you. How very Scottish of you, Louis. Fritz, thanks for the lurk, pal. I'll let that, I'll let that go. Beautiful. Boneless chicken wings. Ooh, you know I love some boneless wings. That's true. Louie, I gotta I gotta give that to you. We know what we get. We know what to expect from you. And that's I appreciate that. You know, three new rubber band loom types. Nice, Liz. Look at you learning and doing all kinds of stuff. Uh all right. Don't care about that. User display name. Okay. Okay, good. Like that. Trigger event chat message. Okay. All right, let's go. Username, user ID name, user display name. Beautiful. Down as bonus wings almost almost makes. Hmm. Aha, Lolly, it doesn't work. Ha ha. It doesn't work because I restarted the bot. Ha ha. Jokes on you. Ha ha. Get wrecked. It's just chicken nuggets without sauce. That's all any boneless wings are. They're just chicken nuggets. They are literally just chicken nuggets. Trigger follow. Username, user ID, user display name. Username, user ID, user display name. Beautiful. All right.
Okay. Turn off my lights. No. No, I will not. Come over to my house and turn them off yourself. This is pretty interesting since it's almost like programming you have to make. CNC shit, CNC shit is amazing to me. Like, I, I could not do a CNC machine. That's just, like... With this, this is different. Like, if I fuck something up with this, it's not a big deal. It's... Like, this is just all software. But in a CNC machine, you have to get it right, or things don't... Like, you could, you could ruin a physical piece of something. Um... Paintbrush is awake. You've awakened the you've you've awakened their 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 cosplay maker senses. That's newfangled machinery, and I'm not for it. Paintbrush, you strike me as the type of person that would like love to run a CNC machine, just like sitting back. You know, paintbrush is sitting back in their glasses and like their their like overalls, just waiting for the machine to finish milling out a piece of something. You were on the robotics team for a reason. That doesn't surprise me not one bit. Not one bit. Why is that in there twice? Oh, cool. Oh, wait, no. Wait, why is, yeah, why is it in there twice? I don't know. Fine, fine. Mishrinium? Jesus Christ, Louis. Of course you have fucked up a mass spectrometer. Of course, because why wouldn't you have? A program, but you love building more? That... That tracks for you, paintbrush. That absolutely tracks. She alarms out and got to figure out. Oh yeah, not hard, but mental. Oh no, 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 no. I, no. People who do machining work. Nope, nope. I'm. I am not that smart. I ain't smart enough for that. I think I'm going to leave that as I think I'm going to leave that as display name for consistency for now, but I don't know. You didn't fuck it up. Well, all right. All right. You ha Louis, you understand why I immediately jumped to the you being the one to fuck something up, right? You are very danger prone. I've, yeah, I've met me. Wait, really, Paintbrush? I didn't know that. I didn't know that's what you were doing. Bruh, I didn't know. There we go. I like that. Yeah. I'll take that. That'll work. Make your brain go burr. It's true. Liz, you Liz, you just like making stuff though. You just like creating stuff. Hmm, degree. Fucking fishing the associates and going for metal arts level too. Fuck yeah, paintbrush. You see, it's just me and one other guy that does it in a shop of 300. Damn. That does have to be nice, though. Like, you know, you don't have a bunch of people. Like, it's 
it's something that's like yours, you know, you got, you have like a sense of ownership over it. And I always enjoy that. Breaking changes. No, Alka. No, maybe. Maybe. Hi, Alka. Love you, buddy. Weldering, soldering, casting, and forging. Oh. oh, that sounds so much fun. I'm taking that out and this. Okay. Okay, I like that. Hi, Perny. Forging. User ID name. Listen, don't... Alka, just don't worry about it. It's going away. It's actually Louie today, Pern. It's yeah, it's true. It's true. Yeah, the name was a combo of the two. No, Alka, it was okay, so to give you a little backstory, um for a lot of stuff under the hood, username we were using we were using username as a value for the display name. And then we added user ID name later to be the actual username, and it was just a lot of confusing stuff. So now I'm just trying to standardize. So usernames are usernames, user IDs are the actual ID, and user display name is the display name. Just trying to see if I can standardize without breaking too many things, but you know, it's we'll see what happens. Let's see, how many, oh look. 1200 results. Oh. Yeah, it's, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, Louie, it didn't come through, bud. I don't, I don't see it anyway. Let me refresh and see if I... Did it come through in the bot? Yeah, Louie, it didn't come through. Yeah, I don't think it came through. Try to repair the last fellow lose this whole guy. I need a specially licensed tool. And this man do it like a quarter of the price. Small millionaire for the damn Tay. I bet though. Anything about readable colors for the names? Listen. Listen. 
One problem at a time, Alka. Yeah, Louis, it might be too long. It, chat might be just dropping it out because it's too many characters or something. Okay. I'll look at it in a little bit. Burnt retinas. Perny, I, I use it in many places. Oh, nice. Nice, Alka. Oh, let's see. Mm -hmm. Active user handler does this under the hood. Well, where's my music? There. I don't know if you cannot redeem it as it is out of stock. Uh, yeah, streak lives on. Actually, I got to turn it off because I keep restarting the bot. And it keeps losing connection to the uh, to the lights, so but yeah, absolutely still counts. Username, username. All right, so a lot of places we're actually doing it the way it's supposed to under the hood. Which is good. I like that. Between pause and disable. So, Perny, when you disable, it disappears from the list completely. So, when you open it up, it will say like it, like it's not. It doesn't even show up. When you pause it, and it will go out of like it'll show up. And it's like, oh, this is temporarily out of stock. Check back later. Kind of like when it's on cooldown. Yeah. Okay, that's the VIP stuff. I think Kitty has doodled. She's doing off doing very important kitty stuff. Tay, hey, sorry about that, buddy. Oh, you're on mobile, Louie? Oh, that's probably why. Yeah, mobile is... Mobile's a pain in the ass. Hmm. I wonder if I can... Go back here.
Beautiful. I like that. What, Perny? Perny, I got some sleep, like a little. A little. I actually slept better last night than I have in several nights. So it's, it's better. Message service. Uh, I don't give a shit. Uh, where's, I was just there. Is it? No. How was it? Oh, I was... There it is. I'm working on it, Perny. It's... Listen, I'm working on it. Oh, God. Hey, I hope the rest of your day goes well, buddy. Love you bunches. Four minutes till you clock out? Fuck yeah, Liz. Thank you, Perny. Love you, Perny. Okay. That'll work. Little bird has place to move into New Mexico. Yes, oh shh. I love that for you, babe. Mm, you're easy like that. Uh, hold on, hold on. I have something for this, Pernt. There you go. That's just for you, Bernie. Come on, you can't. Listen, listen. If you're gonna set them up, I'm gonna knock them down. Uh. <sighs> That's the joke. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's backtrack here a little bit. And... All right, where were we? He's a righty way. No, that's no, that's a, pretty much exactly what it sounds like, Louis. Almost exactly what it sounds like. Okay, command runner. And list. The username. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh.
Okay. Moving around enough lately. I mean, I wasn't going to say it, but... Fine. I just... It's fine. Listen, just tell me you don't love me anymore. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. No, 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 it's fine. 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 Pretty I tease. Okay. Ice Bear needs it for everyday hustling. Perny, thank you for gifting a sub to I love you, you butt. Thanks, Perny. I love you to you butt. All right. I think we're getting really close here to... Finding most of this stuff. Oh, sh you converted your prime to a tier one. Oh, oh, sh thank you. I don't know that I, I don't think I have an event for that. I don't think I have one. No, I don't. Oh, oh, sh thank you for converting your prime to a tier one. Also, I still have to fix that because that's not a thing that exists. make one I eventually eventually probably I, alerts are on my list of things to update at some point All right, we're going to get down to the events stuff here soon, which is where I am going to need to update things. Osh Ubu? And bills do be bills. Yeah, that's true. Life do be lifing. Boy, howdy, do they ever. Have I ever considered an acting career? Um, Actually, yes, I have. I have, in fact, considered that. <laughs> hung the hat up. Wissy, we'll thank you for gifting a sub to the community. Now, that one went to Flamingo. We love Flamingo. Iceberg needs it for everyday hustle. Also, Squawk Moth, thank you for gifting a sub to Oshi. Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate that. needs it for everyday hustling. And then there's Viv. Viv, sub sounds or sub sound auto sub sounds are turned off. Do your do it, Viv. Do it. Do it automatic. Do it with the thingy. With the who's he thingy. Use the use the use the button, Viv. It is you definitely not Oceanity. <laughs> I had the automatic ones turned off for now because I keep restarting the bot. needs it for everyday hustling. Holy shit, ever. Thank you for gifting five subs. Oh my god. To Colette, Avil, Arb, M Maddie, and Perry. Wow. Holy crap. Button, button. Who's got the button? Flamingo, I cannot explain to you how much I love that movie. I may or may not have the, uh, what is it, like the 40th anniversary box set downstairs somewhere that I got several years ago. Um, oh, wait, I got to do choo-choo. 
That's my train whistle, you see, for the trains. Look, I got a hype train indicator. It tells us that we're at 52% of a level three right there. Completely away from the channel and still get a sub, so you outed yourself. Yes, train whistle for the train. That's, yes. You have to train, to win, win train, train whistle. It is the way of, it is the way of train. All right. Now, let's go... Can I... You pay today, so oh, 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 God, oh, God. Come on, ice bear is ready to Tokyo. Oh, my drift. God, oh, sh thank you for 2500 bits. Holy shit, that just that also reminds me that I gotta work on bits tier badges because I don't have any, and that's well, that's silly. And I wonder if there's an anonymous user. Frankly unacceptable. Yeah, I know. I know. Viv, I am I am I am ashamed. Postman, do postman things. Yes, postman, do postman things. Okay, uh let's see. I need to get user by name. Is there an anonymous? Oh, there is someone who is actually named anonymous. Fuck's sake. Ah. Uh. Anonymous, wait, Anonymous Cheering's gone now? Oh, an Anonymous Cheer is a, it's a placeholder account? Oh, yeah, because it's got, uh, yeah, 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 it's got this guy. Okay, all right. They don't want people cheating to start hype trains. Oh, that's fair. That's fair. Like, seriously, yeah, who who would do that? Who would, yeah, who would, no. Oh, mm, 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 I, I, mm. Placehold your face. I'll, don't threaten me with a good time. I think. I don't know. Okay, well then, in that case, I'm going to leave this as this, even though it's not there, but we're going to do it anyway. I want to go look at the docs. Now, now it's going to bother me. Channel cheer. Yeah, you can anonymously anonymously gift subs, but I guess you can't anonymously cheer anymore. I don't know. The event still returns, potentially returns null. I don't know. I'm just going to leave it the way it is.
We're just gonna leave it. It's fine. I'm sure after this card was being abused. Oh, that long ago? That long ago? Cause how long has this fucking thing been here? I mean, I guess this has been here a while, so. I guess this that just means this always returns false and these always return values. Whatever, fuck them. Him user ID, user display name. How would it be abused? I, <sighs> People were doing anonymous one bit cheer spam. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Which, yeah, sure, but also, like, I don't know, don't set up alerts for one bit or something if it's if people are abusing it in your channel. I don't know. I don't know. He'll try to avoid anonymous bits under 100? That, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, exactly. Right, like we get, we have, we have controls for other shit. Thank you all for the level four hype train. Take the hat off now. Ah. Hey, look at that, I got one too. Look, I got one of those too. I got the I got the ha ha cat and it's a ha ha cat and thank you all very much for all the the subs and the bits and whatnots. I genuinely appreciate it. Okay. Um All right, well I'm gonna leave this for now and just like I don't know. The, the, God the whole thing just ugh. Listen, Alka, it's fine. Ice They've been ready to Tokyo Drift. God damn it, Dennis. Uh, listen, Alka, but like they have more important things that they've been focusing on, like guest star. I mean, stream together. I mean, ping. Oh, oops. We're not supposed to mention that that's where they got that from. Oops. <laughs> I kind of want to go through the event stuff now. I guess I'm in the middle of the event stuff, aren't I? Yes, I am. Fine. What's ping? Um. It was... It's guest star before there was guest star on Twitch. Um... One of the former Twitch devs went, and after he left, he started it, and it's 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 guest star, but it was around before there was a guest star. Um, uh, who was it? That, who is it? Um, fucking, god damn it! What is his name? What's fuck is his name? Fuck is his name? I'm blanking now. Um, hold on, give me a second. I can figure this out. I can figure this out. I'm. I. I gotta figure this out. I just don't know. Theo. Theo. Christ. Thank you. Thank you, Alka. Anyway, yes, Theo Theo started he he started peeing and then like I don't know. 
Like six months later, there was suddenly guest star out of nowhere. Which, I mean, I get it, it's a cool feature, but like... Can we not get the basic shit right before we start going off and making other shit? There's a loaf. She came to say hi. Oh, go to implementations. Go to. Can I, can I peek references, please? Come on. Uh, oh, because the main one is in the. No, yeah. I got to redo that, too. We're just going to do all this. Use right, username, user ID, user display name. From will you leave as user display name? Oh, no, must move fast, must break many things. Yeah. Breaking all of the stuff. That's what we do today, folks. Event.donor name, event.donor ID. I really should just go through all of this and just. That's okay. We'll get there when we get there. So many of these events would get changed. Stuff that never worked 100%. Well, okay. You know, that's. I gotta give you that. Oh, baby. What are you doing? Want to meet her? You got to meet her. You got to. You want uppies? You have to let uppies. There's uppies for the loaf. There's the loaf. Can you say hello? Can you say hello to loaf? Would you like some kisses? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's a loaf. It's a loaf. Oh the loaf. Where's Kitty's cat? You wanna get on the desk? Okay, loaf's gonna help us code. She's gonna help today. She's very helpful. She's very good. If we can see her on the overhead cam. Oh, just the edge. Edge of kitten. Very soft though. No sharp edges here. All soft. All soft. All soft. Got any regexts to write? Uh I mean maybe. Loaf, you wanna walk on the keyboard? She was walking on Bean's uh work laptop keyboard this morning, so Bean doesn't even use regex. Yeah, that's fair point, Perry. Full stack dev kittens cat. It's true. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at all the scritches. Look at all the scritches. Oh, yes. Oh, so very scritchens. Very scritchens. Oh my goodness. She loved the scritch. Hi. Hi. Oh my goodness. I got a big old fuzzy ball. That's 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 your fuzz that came off from all those scritches, little kid. That's your fuzzy. It's all gone. I caught it. It's all gone, fuzzy cat. Oh, Loaf's the cutest ever. Be just a baby. Or just a baby. Do you want to lay down? I made a spot for you. Yeah, I made a spot. Do you want to lay? Look, her, look at her little sock. That's her little sock. Her little peats. Her little sock. Did you say bye, bye? 
She's the best baby. I know. I know. She's the kitty and the cat. Yeah, she loves scratches. It's her favorite. Her favorite. Yeah. Are you doing so good? You're doing very good. Yeah. Oh, she's very good. She's the best kitten. Give loaf. With the loaf nose. Boop, boop. Oh, Snuggle, come here. Oh, kiss it. Oh, kiss it. Oh, Chanko. Oh, Chanko. Hey, bro. What is, what is it? What is it? Did you know that Viv loves you? Yeah. Oh, oh, she, she nuzzled about it, Viv. She's very excited that you love her, Viv. Oh, oh, oh. Are you going to flop? Are you going to flop? Yeah. Oh, oh, my goodness. That shot right there with her looking up. I think just goes to show like how accurate the Luna Loaf depiction that Mochi made is. Hi, baby. Hi, kitty baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. All right. All done? You all done? Yeah. No, oh, I know. I know that's my cuddle cat. She's the best kitty. Best loaf. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No kisses? All right, can they come? No, I know purple. Oh, so, okay, you gotta jump. Whoosh, good job. Good job, love. Good job. So good. So many good scratches. That's her favorite. Soft kitten's cat. I'm soft for her. All right, let's see. I do kind of want to go through all of these and just. We don't get anything for that. Okay. Trigger bits badge unlock. Okay. I hit. I don't know. Okay, it's fine. Uh the best we have for now. Is that still coming over pub sub? Follow. Follow's good. Okay. Goals. Goals we don't use username force because that's specific to the streamer. Hype train same way. Polls. Okay. Predictions. Same thing. Raid we updated. Pretty sure we updated it in here as well. Name, ID, display name. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, I just updated it down there. Okay, perfect. Uh, let's come back here. Reward redemptions, we already did this. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, shout outs. You're gonna add for a Doom lawnmower? A Doom lawnmower? Listen, yes. Where's Lolly? Lolly needs it. Uh, sure, man. What the hell? Event shouted out broadcaster name. Event dot shouted out broadcaster ID. Username. User ID. Perfect. 
Perfect. Post link, yeah. Sure, go for it. I think Loaf has has wandered on. You should post that in the Discord too, Dennis, because I'm not going to see it, and I'm not. I'm I'm going to forget it's here. Username string, user ID string. Yep, 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 yep. User ID, play name. Caster name. ID. Okay. The council's tech. Sure. What the hell? I'm tempted to do this. Name and ID. We could do username, moderator ID. I'm going to leave that that way for now. But I'm going to add these in so that we can. We can use them for later. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Time is it? 3.30. Okay. I mean, we have all this data. We might as well start consuming it at some point. Stream online. Yeah, why are we doing that? I don't know why I did this. I did this. I did this, and I hate it. It is inconsistent and also wrong. Um... Username, ID, display name. Username, ID, display name. That's the way we do it all. Okay. Consistency is key. <clears throat> uh, prime upgrade. Well, I don't have a tr an event for it. That's okay. I swear I heard a kitten's cat. Ah. Uh. Wait, well, stop that. Where was I? Found out that did that? That's good. Alright, I know I'm gonna have to redo all of that. Okay. 
going to let that be for now. I think that's fine. Eventually, I am going to redo that because that shouldn't should be the display name. All righty. Same thing here. This is going to go here. Actually, this all needs to go here. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Put that come in there. We already have moderator, so we could do that. Um, and whisper. All right, now let's go back to our event sub client because we got several things to fix here. All right, let's see where all of our errors are. Okay. Trigger timeout, so we have event dot username, event dot User ID, user display name, dot moderator name, event dot moderator ID, event dot moderator display name. Beautiful. And that's all that there. Yep, username, user ID, display name, username, ID, display name, and reason. Okay, trigger unbanned. Username ID display name. Moderator ID display name. Okay. Okay. Everybody's happy here now. Good. Love that. I think that's everything in those events. Let's see, where do I trigger the whisper? Aha! Message dot user info. Oh, dot. Right. Let's see. User info display name. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Exactly what I expected. All right. Boy, this is going to be a hella beta cycle. I can feel it already. <sighs> hey, what are you doing? Hey, cat. 
wandering around being a kitten. Do do. Good call, Arb. Thank you. I don't have a type on there, so yeah. Thank you, thank you. Good, good call. Um. Hello, loaf. What are you doing? Are you being a kitty? Yeah. Oh yeah. Very much a kitty cat. He's very much a kitten's cat. Uh, let's come down. So many of these events now are Oh, I don't care about that. Okay. That's that restriction. Yep. Chat roles manager. Oh, that's the known bot list. Yep, that's fine. Yep. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All usernames. Uh huh. Yep. I did all this already as part of that refactor. Accounts. Streamer. Username. Uh huh. Ooh, you know what? That's a good call. Good, good call. Good call, me. Yeah. Yeah, I love that. What are you doing? All right. Okay. Hi, Alf. How's it going? We got an ad starting in a couple minutes. I may take a short break when the ad starts. I'm doing all right. Doing good. Breaking a lot of stuff today, which I'm really, I'm always excited about. Work meeting. Nice. Nice. Enjoy the break between meetings. Uh, let's see. Sometimes you have to break it to know what to fix. That's very true. That's very true. Well, this should break on here because I haven't modified this. Let me see something. Uh, hi, Tawny. Who we got? Target. That's me. That provides that. Channel ID. Type. Okay, so that's all we get, huh? Symbol. Data. Of course. Of course. Okay. Well, that's exactly. Uh, 
I want to... Mm, you know what I'm going to do? No, here's what we're going to do. Yeah, that doesn't work. I God, I've... Um, I've done most of the role we rework at this point. Uh, now I'm just working on... Um, well, I'm changing how username works. I'm changing how username works. Also, this doesn't work. This is that stupid thing where it tells you that you've been you've been removed as a VIP, not when someone's been removed as a VIP on your channel, which I don't. I, uh. Yeah, like all the role rework stuff, we use IDs under the hood now, or we will when it comes out. Um, but yeah, oh, that's not going to break anyway. Okay. Um, that's fine. All right. Ads just started. I will be right back. Oh, okay. Uh, I'm back. I'm really tempted to take this out because we check on chat anyway. So, I don't know. Oh, that's not, that didn't change the signature. That did, but I fixed it already. That didn't change the signature. That did, but I've, I think I fixed that already too. Yes, because we had that whole discussion about anonymous. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Uh, I think I fixed this already. Yep. I didn't change the signature here, and honestly, I'm not going to fuck with this right now. Ugh.
Alco, why do they keep getting shit in event sub only 95% correct? Why do they keep missing shit in event sub, Alco? Why? Why are they doing this to us? Why do they keep doing it? Like, what the fuck, man? I was looking at stuff last night, and... The... Chat notification... Event, right? Great stuff in here. Great, great stuff. Except we have things like... <clears throat> The gift paid upgrade. Okay, gift paid upgrade. Great. So, we know someone has upgraded their gift sub to a paid sub. We can get information about the gifter. We know the information about the chatter. But why? Why doesn't it tell us what tier? Because we get that in IRC today. Why didn't they give us the tier here? Right? They gave us the tier for the prime paid upgrade. Why didn't they give us the tier for the gift paid upgrade? I mean, at least it tells us now when someone, we actually have an is prime, when someone subs or resubs, which is nice, that we don't have on like the regular subscriber event. <clears throat> like there's, there's like, it's like they give us stuff, but then it's like, mm, but wait. Just like, can you just be consistent? Where's the flag to tell us that it's sometimes somebody's first chat? Like, what? A missed thing in the docs? No, it's not in there. It's not in there, Alf. People have checked. It's It's just not there. Yeah, I mean, one would hope, but no. Also, I lo like I like that the incoming raid has a thing, the unraid has a thing, but I would like to see one for outgoing raids, so that we know when a like a raid has been initiated by the broadcaster of the channel, not when someone else is raiding in. Like th this is great, this is great, and I love that it also includes like the profile image URL of the user so that that saves you a call, but also like, I mean like an outgoing raid event to go with the unraid event. I don't know. I'm pretty high on the user voice, that, are they? Ooh, here, Alka, you wanna go upvote something for me too? While you're, uh, while we're doing stuff. Here we go. This is one that I was look again. Add cumulative subscribe months for sub gift notices. Did that get? Some gift. That's cumulative total. That's duration months. But also, we don't have one for... So there's two right there. So the first one is... We have events for clearing the chat, clearing user messages out of chat, like if you time out someone, and for in deleting individual messages. It includes the information about the broadcaster and in context of the user, the user. So like if you delete a user's message, the user whose messages got deleted, but we don't get information about the moderator that performed the action like we do with other stuff today. So like when a moderator bans or unbans somebody or times someone out, or when they enable or disable shield mode on a channel, we get the information about the moderator who did that action. We don't get that with this. And I understand like part of the point of this is to be able to subscribe to a channel that you don't have moderator or streamer privileges on. But if you get, like if you use a, a 
the token of a user or an app that does have moderator or streamer privileges on this, I would think that you should get the moderator information for this so that you can, you know, have that. Like, I know in my feed who does these actions in my mod actions panel on my stream manager in mod view. Like, I get all that there. I should be able to get that information from event sub as well. Uh, the other one is... Um, this one's, this one came in from somebody else a couple weeks ago, channel chat notification sub gift doesn't include the field for the cumulative number of months. The gift recipient's been subscribed to the channel. IRC provides this today and channel chat notification is supposed to be a drop in replacement for the user notice stuff in IRC, but we don't have this field. Does it come through pub sub chat moderator actions? Uh, yes. So here's my, um, let's see, do I have any mods around? I don't know that I do. Oh, I can't break on it right now anyway. But yeah, I'm I'm almost certain that it comes through here. My bot is mod. That's true. All right, let's restart the bot then cuz I did modify this code. Let's restart the bot in the middle of this massive breaking change that I'm making. Have I been hydrated? Have I hydrated late? Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I just don't know how to speak. I don't know how to articulate my mouth to form words. They're not, it, I don't word very great. Mmm, soup. I like soup. I want soup now. All right. Words are overrated, that's true. Very true. Oh, Tani. Tom's not here, buddy. I'm going to have to refund that. I'm sorry. I should have turned that off earlier. I keep forgetting to turn off. No, Tom Tom hasn't been here. Tom hasn't been here. He's 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 almost never on daytime streams. And oh, and the reverse is down too. Reversing the points. Because the bot's down, you see. I'll give you a free one when the bot restarts. <clears throat> Reverse! Reverse! There you go, Tani. That one's just for you, pal. Um, well, not everything's broken yet. That's good. This one's going to have to bake for a while. The only error I got right now is the usual 7 TV because I don't have a 7 TV account. Oh, Dennis, I saw. I saw. Very soft, fuzzy kittens, cats. Very, very soft. Um, all right, let's see what we got here. Uh, let me open a I'm logging into Twitch in in private browser. So deadly. <sighs> you know, I get it's Twitch, but like for once, could you just not like have stuff playing on the page when you open the page? Just could you not? 
What if you didn't, though? Alf, thanks for stopping by, pal. It's good to see you, as always. I hope you have a good meeting. Hope things go well. All right, let's go. All right, I'm going to set it to subscribers, see what happens. Oh, shit. I didn't... I guess I could just turn it back off. Okay. Uh, message, username. Yep. Message includes the username and ID of the moderator who performed the action um, when chat mode is changed. Now let's see if I... Let's continue. Now let me go delete a message... Um, Dennis, type some gibberish in chat. I'm deleting your message, you bastard. Delete this. How dare you? How dare you, Elka? Message, username, the bot. Action, delete. There's the actual, like, information about it, including... The chatter, the message, the message ID, and then there's all that. So, yep, that's, we get that information. Damn you, Dennis. That's all right, I, I, I killed the breakpoint. But yeah, so, PubSub sends it, Alka. Pub sub does. Why wouldn't event sub? Like, you're so, you're you're almost there, man. Like, you're so close, Twitch. You're so close. You're just like right there, just right there. Ah, oh, it's just frustrating, you know it. Like, we just want to make good stuff, but then, like, but then stuff's broken or doesn't work right. Those I fixed. Those I fixed. Those I didn't touch. Those I fixed. Okay. But yeah, like the... Like even the chat message delete event. We get the ID of the message, but which I mean, I guess is fine, but we don't get the content of the message, which I believe IRC also provides to us, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, so there's the channel, the message ID, and then the message, which includes I think it includes like username and text and yeah, I just I don't know it just it's just annoying, it's just one of those little things it's like. Like, I appreciate that they're, they're working on stuff, and I understand that, you know, they're doing stuff. But, like, can you give us the... Like, can you give us the the stuff that you already have? Like, why? Well, this isn't better. It's not better. It's just, it's different and slightly not as good. 
I don't know. I just... Uh, it's frustrating. Especially when we're trying to build nice stuff. We just want to build good stuff. Let us build good stuff. All right, let's move down past the events. Keep going. Oh, we went past integrations, roles, timers. We got to pub sub. This. This is just the API stuff, which is fine. Currency. Aha. Username, user, okay. We're gonna do it again. Perfect. She's not in here. Oh. She's singing us the song of her people. That I'm okay leaving for now. Okay. We'll add that. Be good. Okay. Okay. Wait a minute. Oh, you know what I could do? I mean, no explicit any. Oh, right. Because I never did do a thing for this. Why? Why are you doing this? Oh. Well, we're just going to fix that, aren't we? We're just going to fix all this, aren't we? Hey, what's Expressionish doing down here? Oh. Expressionist is doing expressionist things. Okay, that's fine. Neat. That's cool. Okay, happy with that. And Uh, yeah, we're going to leave that for now. Froze back and so No, no, Tani, I am, uh, I am not a, I'm not an Apple person. I don't, I don't use Apple stuff. Just not my cup of tea. VR is not really my thing much either. I don't know. I just, eh. I'm waiting until they perfect it, and you know how that goes. I'm just living in the real world. I yeah, like it's nice out here. I mean, it's it's not you know it's not the best, but there are good parts, like kitten's cat. I like petting the kitten's cat. Uh, that I'm going to leave the fuck alone for now. Uh, 
Let's see, it's the pronoun stuff. That's fine. User is banned. User's timed out. The roll stuff I've already done. Done all this, this I'm not worried about. Play name, display name. Okay. Now we're getting into UI stuff. Ooh. All right, I'm going to stop and restart. See what happens. <clears throat> Yes, we can only see the data through fairly opaque blinds. It's true. It's true. Yeah. Eh, I mean, it's going to be fine. Oh, what a break. Oh. There we go. Then I can take that out because we actually get a, we get that back now. Yep. Okay. Boy, it's nice moving stuff to TypeScript. I gotta tell you, I really enjoy it. What don't you like now? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't like the... Okay, what is that? As Helix Bits leaderboard period? Okay. I'm just going to stick this back down here as a const. Put you back in a require. Sure. Oh, right, because we don't, yeah, we pull that from, yeah. That's just a GitHub reference, not a package.
All right. Starting back up. Okay, we got display names. I mean, I ain't mad at it. My overlays are reconnected. Uh, that's not going to change. Um, hey, Dennis, you want to redeem uh, reverse or something for me? Do what kind of activity feed stuff we get here? I mean, that looks really good to me. No, go back over here. <gasps> There's a kitty. There she is. Telling about stuff. I don't know if you're full. That is not full. So many ugly pets. Okay, well, uh, I like that. Um, so let's do something like this. Go shout message. We'll do the default one. Oh, that does does okay. Let's do something more different like I got bonked by a tail. That does that. Huh. I'm trying to think of what else I could do in a test. Checklist. Just... Oh, I have it set up to like at them in chat. Okay, well then that actually ends up working out for me anyway. I think. <gasps> what was that loaf? The beam? Loaf's going to check on beans. She heard a bonk. Ooh. Okay. Biggs has approved it and. Roll refactor is. I'm gonna squash and merge this, I think. Uh, mm, eh, eh, mm, yeah, I'm gonna squash and merge. Yeah, that's fine. Because most of this was just all like. Uh, well, no, no, you know what? No, we're just, we're just gonna, yep, yep. I'm gonna tr bring all of my cruft with it. I'm gonna dirty up the friggin' commit log. And goaded with a side helping of sauce. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh, Osh, I love that for you. I love that for you so much. All right, let's go mark some stuff. Custom viewer roles do not update when usernames are changed on Twitch. Release pending. Viewer arrived does not correctly filter non-English characters and usernames. By viewer roles, the viewer arrived event. Where's my music? Thank you. 
Curse you, YouTube. Actual get squash commit. Nice. It's because there's a pumpkin, you see. Um, uh, let's see. This is release pending. Non-English. Do we have anything else that's in... Japanese, Korean, okay, that's part of that one, Chinese, okay, Unicode, okay, uh, well, that got merged, um, Good thing I'm on the roll refactor branch. Pull that. Let's move. Are you gonna let me do it? <gasps> did you let me do it? You did let me do it, you friggin' Yes, I love that. Alright, let's go. Let's create a branch. D5 user name refactor. Create and switch to branch. Roll refactor is dead. Long live username refactor. All right, this one I'm going to sit on for several not nows. But merge conflicts are peak streaming. Just think of the drama, the content, Osh, the content. <laughs> uh. The intrigue. <laughs> Just sitting there like Stefan from SNL, like, this code base has everything. Hi, little no. I turned around and she's like, meow, meow. Hi, meow, meow. What are you doing? In the meow, meow. Her, her, kitten, cat. Oh, my goodness. Hey, baby. She's baby kitten. Um, I mean, we have display names over here, along with the username, user display names are being shown over here. I'm very happy with the way this is looking right now, as far as, let's go back to the events. All right, let's close everything else right now. We've got a lot of stuff open. Raid, we know we'll get that. Yep. Okay. Or. The sub. We know that'll come through. That's a. I'm sub upgraded. Do. Where's, let me go look at that. Username, user ID, user display name. Yep. I'm gonna move that up because consistency. Username, ID, display name, username, ID, display name. That's the way it works. All right, let's go. This is the GIF sub upgrade.
Give sub upgrade. Uh, wait, I'm here. Name. Username, user ID, user display name. Yep. Chat listener. Okay. Y'all got one of these? Uh, sub info. The name, the display name. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. Um. Okay, this is Cheers. I know Cheers we get it for. And it's bit badge unlocked. I don't know that we get that for Bits Badge Unlocked. I don't know that we do. <clears throat> we get the ID and the username, but we don't get the display name. Wait. We're going to do it like that for now because... User ID, user display name. Well, get display name, we can just grab it off a of helix, right? We could, but here's the thing, Dennis. Uh, this is a that callback has to return void. So, I mean, I can make a promise in here, I guess. Uh, I guess, I don't know. I mean, eventually this is gonna get updated anyway. Like, where is event sub? Chat notification. Bits badge tier. And in bits badge tier, we get the tier and we have the chatter's ID, name, and login. So, eventually this will become a moot point when we change this over to chat notification. Cause this, this one is actually one that we can use with chat notification. I already checked. And so this is just a stop gap, which it's not that big of a deal, honestly. Um, This is the first time shatter, or this is viewer arrived. 
Uh, viewer arrived, we already do it with, right? Yeah, we should. Chat. No. Viewer arrived is its own thing. Yep, we updated those. So that's good. Okay. Halfway through. First time chat. I know we get first time chatting. What are you doing there, pal? Uh, what is this? Ban, we get it. Unban, we get because it's events. I know what like event sub is nice because we actually get all this data. Timeout, and channel reward redemption. Whisper, whisper, whisper. Yes, because we get that from. Uh, blah, 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 IRC. Shout out sent. Yep, I know that. And shout out received. Okay, um, I'm happy with all of that. That's all the places that we were using username here. Um, all right, this one I'm gonna have to let bake for a while. Like, I know it's, I have high confidence in it, and, but I, I really need to let it bake. I gotta watch for events. I gotta do all kinds of stuff. Uh, what I can do is in some of these see like I know that'll work. Hi hidden. Hidden, you got to do your sub sound because I have them turned off right now because I kept restarting the bot. Bye, I love you. And now I love you. Nice, Viv. Nice. See, Viv. Viv knows when. Look at that, Viv. What a what a nice. What a friend. What a pal. What a duck. Uh, run effect list. Yeah, feed alert. This is the one that's, I can just disable this. Nope, not duplicate. Disable, thank you. Yeah, we don't get that right now either. Disable. Okay. Dude, Yakuza games are just, there's all kinds of just wild stuff in there. It is a trip to watch people play Yakuza games. OK. 
Okay. It's fine. I think I'm gonna do take this out and just do like that. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Oh, I gotta disable that. I gotta go. Uh, disable event actually. I need to go unlink stream elements because I don't use stream elements anymore. Yeah. You're dead, so you'd be just asking me to forget again. Oh my god. Stream elements, who's she? I've never heard of her Alka. Just rolling up like Mariah Carey with your sunglasses is like, I forgot how to read suddenly. Listen, it's not that, you know, it's not because Firebot does everything or like I can, I'm getting donations like tipping elsewhere. It's because the stream elements guys are actually, like the owners are actually terrible. So, charity donation from Tiltify. I'm going to leave that here even though I don't have Tiltify enabled right now. I love my retro alerts so much. They're so good. Web sockets. Yeah, Dennis. Yeah, I'm trying to get a couple of places to add web sockets. I'm trying to get fourth wall to add them right now. Because if I could get fourth wall alerts for shit, I'd write a script for it tomorrow. Fucking. What is this? It's so good. They do have API polling, but I don't want to use API polling. I don't that's that's old and busted. I just love my retro alerts so much. They're so good. Anyway. Um that's gifted, that's gifted. Cheer. You're anonymous. Oh, the the raid one is so good. Where is it? So good. It's 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 so good. I love it so much. Lockhart, stop sending me TikToks.
He's like, no. You can feel it. Uh, I can delete this one. What is... Oh, that's right. That's still the default stuff because I never did make retro versions of that. I love that my default for testing is Trans Lifelines logo. Just mwah. love that. Love that for me mostly. I mean, they're great, but also love that for me. Okay, I don't think I have anything else that's I need to get rid of. No, okay, everything's good. I stopped, like, when I went to TwitchCon uh, this past year, back in October, I guess it was. Uh, yeah, when I went to TwitchCon in October, uh, I must have walked by and hung out at the Trans Lifeline booth, like, six times can you have two overlays through firebot at one time yes ma'am you can here i'll show you something all right let's just let's just let that be okay so uh so listen hidden so over here this the news bar on this scene this news bar here and this setup this is a firebot overlay then I have my like Ice Bear is ready to Tokyo Drift. That's a separate Firebot overlay. Then Reverse. that is Reverse. a third Firebot overlay. I have so you can go if you go down to your settings down here. Go to overlay. And then what you can do is you can turn on overlay instances, which will let you have multiple overlays. Then you edit your instances and you get ones for different things. Like I've got a default one, I've got the news bar, I've got the top sheet, which is the one that goes over like everything. The default one's the one that just stays up there in the content area. Um, and you can get URLs for all of them. So like, it'll tell you what the URL, so the default one, that's like the local version, or if you're using like a, like a direct link, you can use that. Uh, if you're using a different one, like the news bar, it has a different URL because it adds the instance name at the end so that we know what events to listen for in the overlay. Because what happens is the overlay is just a WebSocket connection back to Firebot. It just opens up a connection and then Firebot, like whenever there's overlay stuff, Firebot's like, hey, do thing for overlay news bar. And then the overlays go, oh, I'm news bar. Okay, I'll do that. Oh, no, I'm not news bar. I don't care. So it just broadcasts out the overlay events to the different instances. And that's it. Um, and then when you're doing stuff like showing an image, then once you go down here, you can say it'll, when you have overlay instances enabled, it will drop down and ask you which instance you would like to put it on. And that's it. That's all there is to it. So as soon as you turn on instances, you get the drop down and you're like, hey, I can do stuff. You can ask, you can do your instances here. You can get the URLs and bickety bam, wherever you want to go. You're very welcome, Hidden. It is my pleasure. Um, all right, well, I think we're going to get ready to wind it up here, uh, wind it down up. I don't know. We're going to be done here in a second. Oh yeah. Does this work? I wonder if this works. Do you work? Turn down for what?
Oh, right. I have to... Did I actually do this? I don't know that it did. Let's try it again. Run it and... Oh, there it is. There's my ad data. I don't use anything but fry rot for streaming. Um... No. I mean, I have other stuff that I use, so like... Um... Like I have... Like I have sound alerts, you know, obviously, because people can do sounds for bits. Um, but the, as far as alerts and stuff, no. Firebot is all I use for alerts. That's all I use. Everything I do is in Firebot, as far as that stuff is concerned. It's not out yet, I don't think. I don't think I can do this yet. Does this also have the events? Damn, can't do it yet. Uh, coming soonish to a firebot near you. An event when an ad break starts. Soonish. We're waiting for updated. The library that we use to connect to Twitch, we're waiting for updated release from them. Mm -hmm. And I want to play Minecraft. Thanks until next ad break as well. Uh, one thing at a time, Dennis. But maybe if you ask nicely. I'll think it over. Is there a way to tell if channel point prediction was canceled as opposed to ending successfully? Um, not yet. Not yet. Uh, Dennis is working on that though. Yep. Dennis has been very excited to work on polls and prediction expansion. In fairness, I got very tired working on all the event sub stuff. Not that I don't, not that I didn't like it. It's just that it was a lot. And, and leave Cave's name in there because we love her very much. 
Uh, okay, we love you. She, she can't hear me. But she was the last one to touch this. Look, there she is, right there. If one prediction variable, we're going to 10, yes. I think predictions was like the last thing you worked on and I just, I ran out of steam. Like I just, I was just like, I have, I have nothing left. Yeah, it's cause I did that one. That one's me. I did it. And I want to put my name in there, cause fuck, f fuck you guys. I'm I'm doing stuff. <clears throat> uh, where's the thing that I had a thing for this? Overlay, look, this is working. Assign the event to the overlay, but now the event isn't testing slash working. This is my name written in for. Uh, none, but you know what? I could make you one Alka. We're going to go, you know what I could do? Alka, do you want me to put an Easter egg in with your name, buddy? You want to, you want to be the person that got timed out, the like the default one? I mean, it would work out because your username and your display name are different capitalizations. Perfect. That's just for you, buddy. Just for you, pal. <laughs> Uh, they were naughty. That's that right there. That's that's why you think you broke it, and I I have faith in you, hidden. Where's the yof? Yof. But not in your new one. In your, when you did your URL for the new one, did you tell it a local file or did you tell it a URL? Because OBS is wonky like that. It cannot be a local file. It has to be a URL. Okay, you did do URL? Okay. Make sure you might have to click on the, the browser source and click the little refresh button. To refresh it too. There's a loaf. What are you doing, baby? There's a loaf on the toolbox. It says local by the link. That's fine. That's fine. As long as it's as long as you did a URL and not a You can do direct, you don't have to hidden for your setup. You like the Yeah. Hey, that no, that's not for kitties. No cables for kitties. That's right. No cables for kitties. Kitties don't get cables. Kitties get kisses. Kisses for kitties. That's right. Mwah. No, just kisses for kitties. Mwah. Love you. No, quit, quit messing with the, quit touching the cables. You're not for kitties. Yeah, thank you. That's kisses. I love you. She wants to floss her teeth with electricity. No, absolutely not. Um. 
didn't. Uh, oh, by the way, Dennis. Dennis, I gave you I I uh I gave you a present. I don't know if you saw. You see the present I gave you, Dennis? Me and uh, me and CKY we were talking last night, and I was like, "Fuck it, Dennis is asleep. Let's do it." So I did. Let's see. Wasn't there a thing for like? What is this? Oh, that, oh. Yeah. That won't work with dollar sign true? No, that's why you don't use dollar sign true. Yes, that's why you don't use dollar sign true. That's why the instructions say just write the word true. See, Alka gets it. For real, not even for play play. Oh, you want user ID also, huh? God damn it. Fine. You know what? Fine. <laughs> Jesus. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna hate myself for this. I'm gonna hate myself for this. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Do kids do kids say do the youth say that anymore, Alka? Do they do that anymore? I don't know that they do. No. <laughs> hidden hidden. Quiet you. Do 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 do. I feel like I should be eating the cranberry sauce right now. And be Riz now, but I'm too old. I don't think you know what that's Colette hard same hard same pal. I'm I I used to be with it, then they changed what it was. You, you're not even the youngest. Also, this is this is hotline bling. Let's just go down to this part here. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I have username 18 times, I have user display name 18 times, I have user ID 18 times. There we go. Okay, CKY is getting his... his stuff. Ooh, I wonder if this works now. Because it works. Let's see. Dang. Oh, 
Oh wait, I can do. I can do that now. <laughs> Wasn't it uh, next add at data zero next next add at Don't we use this still? Isn't this still a thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Lol. Is it not percent? What is it? Is it at? And... Well, I'm never going to fucking find it that way. That's all the... Oh, that's fucking... No. I don't... We just put out this feature. I don't even remember how the hell it works. You ever just not know? Sometimes I don't know. That's preset logs. Checked outputs. Oh, it's ampersand. It's ampersand. Yeah, I don't fucking know. I just work here. Remember to dumb program. You saw last week debating subject. Can you do it? Go. Do it. Do it, Bird. You won't. All right, ampersand. Did he put it inside of single quotes? Damn it, reject. Stop using single quotes. Oh, yeah, I can do that. That's right, I can do that. Ha 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 ha. Oh, yeah. Programmers exclaim when they want to celebrate something. I'm mad at you now. You and your hip hip array. Mad at you. Next ad break. Thing. All right, let's now let's go. Do we got a I got a date and do we not have a thing to format time? We have no. You're really going to make me do this, don't you? Whatever. Listen, it kind of works. Hmm. Let me just go. Listen, I just want to I just want to look. I just want to look. Hey. Hey. Oh. That. Gotta redo those cables down there. You keep messing with them, silly cat.
date and time are in here. Specific format. Format follows moment. Goober. You're a goober and I love you. No, I love you, kitten. Message preview in the edit view. Uh... Like here? No. No, we can't preview. We don't. <clears throat> we can't evaluate here because a lot of the stuff that we put here is in context of like an event. So we don't necessarily have the data at the time. Like we can test and it will give us, it'll run the effect, but we can't like have a preview of what that data is going to be like live. But, like for a lot of stuff. I can go like this and we have, I specifically added the log message. God's sake, there's so much shit going on. Yeah, okay. I don't have, that variable's not populated right now. If I disable this, And I run this and I get, it actually populates the variable. Now it's actually there. So. Uh, all right. I think we are going to call it there. Um, listen, I'm not mad at this. I, like, did I break a bunch of stuff? Yes but it seems like it's working mostly, so I'm not mad at that either. Um, so that'll be good. I mean, listen, people's names and stuff are showing up here, which is great. I love that for me. So I think we're gonna just, uh, we're gonna call it here and hope for the best. All right. Um, <clears throat> I will be back on Sunday to finish Death Spank, hopefully. And then next week I'll be starting something new. I gotta figure out what that is. I don't know exactly what yet, but we'll figure it out. Oh, hey, I'm on this scene, so I can just go here and go... There we go. Look, that's a thing. Anyway, uh, yeah, so I'll be back on Sunday to finish Death Spank. Uh, normal time, 7 p.m. Eastern. What else? Um... Yeah, new stuff next week, and then uh, that's gonna be about it. So, uh, thank you all for hanging out. As always, I really appreciate it. Uh, thank you for the hype train earlier and all the subs and the bits and all that fun stuff. Uh, let's get out of here. Let's go see who's doing what. Who is doing the stuff and the things? Oh, D's playing Tears of the Kingdom. Yeah, we're gonna go see D. We're gonna go see D, cause... Um, where's my... Yeah, we're absolutely gonna go raid D. There are the uh, raid messages. Top one's for subscribers. Bottom one is for anybody who chooses to go pew 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 with the raid. Um, let's grab those and go spam her chat with all the love and stuff because D is a goddamn delight and I love her very much. Uh, all right, I will see you all on Sunday for the conclusion of Death Spank um, and then uh, we'll go from there. Uh, but as always, please remember folks, be good to yourselves, be good to each other. I will see you on Sunday, and um, get out of my house. Bye. I love you. <laughs>